Hello, good evening. Welcome to our channel, Hugh She Talks. And today we will be talking about tennis legend Serena Williams and what was her relationship with Donald Trump. Is she still friends with him? We'll get to know. Let's get started. Serena Williams has refused to address her relationship with former President Donald Trump even after she was revealed to be on his frequent call list in his testimony at his criminal trial. Williams, who had ended her career just under two years ago and is now considered by many as the greatest player of all time, in an interview published on Saturday by New York Times, Williams was asked about being one of the Trump's contacts. I mean, is this what this interview is about? She responded to the reporter David Marquez. When somebody has a chance to talk to a president, I'm curious what they talked about. The reporter replied, I talked to a lot of presidents. I spoke to Barack. I spoke to Clinton. I spoke to every president since I've been in alive, including Ronald Reagan. I'll have you know, Williams said shot back. What do you think they are looking for in talking to you? What do they want to know? The reporter asked. I don't know, and I'm not going there, Williams said. Trump was convicted on all 34 felony counts at his hush money trial last month. The charges stem from a payment shortly before 2016 election to adult actor Stormy Daniels, who alleged that she had an affair with Trump in 2006. Williams was dragged into Trump's trial when a former aide revealed that she was a part of a group of people that Trump spoke to frequently in early 2017 when he entered the White House. Madeleine Westerhout, former executive assistant to Trump at the White House, took the stand in May as she testif uh, testified. Prosecutors showed emails between Westerhout and Rona Graf, a Trump organization employee. Could you have the girls put together a list for me of people that he frequently spoke to? I don't want to uh, have to bug you all the time, even though I will still can often. Westerhout wrote to Graf on 24 January 2017 for four days after Trump's inauguration. Graf soon sent an Excel spreadsheet of those people that Trump frequently spoke to with Williams on that list. Others mentioned including Trump family members, his former fixer Michael Cohen, who testified against him at the trial of former Trump organization CFO Alan Wieselberg and former and current cable new host Bill O'Reilly. Uh, Jeannie Pro Piero and Joe Scarborough were on the list. Williams is reported to have let Trump score a point when they played uh, in a celebratorial match uh, for a new tennis center at the Trump National Golf Club in Sterling, Virginia. That summer, Trump announced his first run for the president. So that's all we have in today's video. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.